July 16, 1945. New Mexico desert. The world's first atomic bomb test. Scientists watched a light brighter than 1,000 suns, then begged their government to never use it. 1939. Einstein writes to President Roosevelt, Germany is building a uranium superweapon that could vaporize entire cities. America responds with the Manhattan Project, a $2 billion secret program. 130,000 workers build a hidden lab in Los Alamos, New Mexico. Most don't even know what they're creating. The mission? Beat Hitler to the bomb. Trinity Test, 529 AM. The explosion creates a mushroom cloud seven miles high. Sand turns to radioactive glass. A crater 10 feet deep appears instantly. Physicist Robert Oppenheimer watches and whispers, Now I am become death, the destroyer of worlds. Scientists realize they've unleashed something unstoppable. Some try to quit. The government says no. July 1945. 70 scientists, including Nobel Prize winners, sign the Szilard petition begging President Truman, don't drop this on civilians. He ignores them. August 6th, little boy bomb destroys Hiroshima. 80,000 dead in nine seconds. August 9th, fat man hits Nagasaki. 40,000 more gone. Japan surrenders six days later. This weapon was so horrifying. No nation has dared use one in war for 80 years. The scientist's nightmare became humanity's greatest deterrent. But one scientist leaked the plans to the Soviets and died mysteriously. Part two, Monday. So, subscribe.